GlaxoSmithKline is spending about $150 billion to market Ally, but will it be a miracle weight loss pill? Jeanette Jenkins has fat chance. She is author of the Hollywood Tra Trainer Weight Loss Plan, but Dr. Mark Siegel says overweight Americans should give it a shot. He's an associate professor at the NYU School of Medicine and author of False Alarm. So, Jeanette, this worries you. Why? Oh, this pill is a big fat lie. How much time do you have for me to give you all of the information that will let you know how bad this pill is? Number one, all you have to do is turn the back of the box over, which tells you most people only lose five to ten pounds in six months. This is nothing to brag about. But they also it's lose 20 percent more than they would normally, right? Um, uh, it, if you tell me that you're going to come to me and I can only let you lose five to ten pounds in six months, that's nothing to brag about. All right, Doctor, what do you think of that? Much to do about nothing. Well, look, we have an obesity epidemic in the United States. This is an arrow in our quiver. Uh, we need to have it. It works some of the time. It works better if you have a low-fat diet. Most importantly, Neil, since it's not absorbed, we're not talking about something that can have systemic side effects. We were talking about ephedra a while back. That can interfere with caffeine, with coffee. That's a much more dangerous situation. Well, what about situation. these unpleasant side effects? Well, You're okay, spending that, a lot of time in the bathroom. That limits it. I grant that. If you don't have a low-fat diet, this is only going to work for some percentage of the population. But it doesn't deserve so to be... So all these a, people, doctor, I mean, this, this is really one of, one of the most incredible days in over-the-counter medicine history, I'm told, because you can't cannot find this thing. It, it, everyone is buying it, and it ain't cheap. Well, you know why. People want what they can't have. People want what they think is new. Fact is, it's not new. It has been around for a while. It's in a smaller form now, lower dose. It's worth a try. It is not a panacea. All right, Jeanette. That alone should tell yeah. you. If it's not new, it's been out since 1999. If it had such great results, this person would have told that person, would have told the next person. Yeah, but and isn't it a little different, Jeanette, when, it, when you don't need a prescription for it, when it's well, readily first available? Well, you're going on false promises. You're saying that you, you, people are overweight from eating too much fat. People are overweight from eating too much sugar, too much processed foods, and we've spent the last 20 years proving research that you need healthy fat to help you even burn fat. You need omega-3 fatty But Jeanette, you acids. want people you to be, Jeanette, get careful. Jeanette, you want people to be healthy, right? Of course you, you, I want and, people and, to be healthy. And if this is a step in that direction, and they oh, know, but, but like, get careful. Don't fat yell, you're yelling at me, Jeanette, and you scare I'm me when sorry. you do that. So when, <laughs> when, when, when people want to step in that direction and lose weight, um, this is a start, right? Why are you not no, being a start? No, it's not because fat is an essential macronutrient that your body needs. It needs it to create serotonin if you're depressed. It needs it to create to help uh, bring oxygen to the muscle cells so you can burn fat. It needs it. Your body needs fat for so many Does things. Does it, doctor? We need. We, I getting, guess we need some fat. We don't need all of it. We're right? getting our fat anyway. I I agree with her. It's not that well tolerated. Of the I disagree with her. I think it's effective. In I think it's worth a shot, and it works in a lot of people. Fat. All right, so uh, Jeanette, even, hold yeah. on. I want to get one thing. Doctor, so you're saying this isn't a, a magic bullet, but it's a start. And, and all these people across the country are apparently buying this out like crazy. You can't go into a store shop to find it. Are, are, are they, is it wishful thinking? Well, it's wishful, wishful thinking, thinking in the sense that they may have the side effects and be not able to tolerate it. If you can tolerate it, there's no downside to it. It's not absorbed. I agree with Jeanette that we need more exercise. We you need a better lifestyle. You tell me there's no downside of all these people... Uh, are being warned, you know, you might wear dark clothing, it might be a good that, bet, you might be one of, close to a bathroom. Someone starts telling me that, I say, you know what, uh, well, I'll just maybe have half a slice of pizza. They're not going to the tolerate it, Neil. I agree yeah. with you on that. Okay. It's not well tolerated, but it works. Gotcha. The number one concern I have is that people who are obese are at risk of heart disease. They need that essential fat to help decrease their risk of heart disease. And people who are obese are depressed as well. And so you're taking away the essential fat that they need to create that serotonin to lift their spirits. All right. Well, yeah. there's too much fat. She's wrong about that. We have no, too much fat. We don't need guys. Ninety percent we... of the population is deficient All right. in well, omega-3 fatty acids. Listen, Mike, acids. listen, Mike Finn, who friends, you should just go home and, and eat a Napoleon and quit yelling at me. <laughs> but you did a great job. Thank you very, very much, doctor. Thank you very, very much. And uh, again, this thing is big. Another thing is big. Right now, the district attorney in the Duke lacrosse case announcing, get this, he will resign.